Let's go to Yellowstone. Are you guys ready to go to Yellowstone? Yeah! Yellowstone, here we come. All right, we are officially entering Yellowstone. We were literally like five minutes from our, our Grand Teton campsite. That's actually good to know. All right, we are officially in Yellowstone. And then once you get into the gate, uh, it's like 20 miles to get to the first location. <laughs> we're going to the geyser. All right, so we are at Yellowstone at Old Faithful. We're gonna go check it out. Got my daughter in the backpack. Since uh, she doesn't like to ride in a stroller, let's go check it out. We're here, I can't believe it. Wow, that is amazing. I'm guessing, yep, you can't go in, I guess. Closed for the season due to coronavirus. The Old Faithful Inn is closed for the summer. Oh, that sucks. Oh, man. We can't see inside. Well, we can, it's just we can't go in there. Oh, that sucks. Wow, that's a major bummer. So the inn is closed for the entire year of 2020 because of COVID-19. I wanted to see inside there. I guess we got to come back. So bummed. Look at that thing. Beautiful. And we can't even go inside just to look around. I just want to look at the lobby. Look around. Look at that thing. Old Faithful Geyser, we're here. Wow. I didn't even expect this, but there's a bison. There's a bison right over there. Right here by the uh, Old Faithful. There's a bison just grazing right out there. That's awesome. <laughs> right here. at Yellowstone. <laughs> All right, so we just watched Old Faithful erupt at Yellowstone for the first time. What'd you think? It was real cool. It was, huh? What'd you think, guys? Awesome. Awesome? It, it took a long time ago for it to erupt, <laughs> but it was cool. It took a long time. Yeah, it sure did take a long time. All right, so we finally made it to the Grand Prismatic Spring. It took forever, the rainbow but light. we made it. Look how red it is. I know, it's the minerals. Look at the minerals. It's going right into the river, too. Okay, there's this little tiny walkway you got to stay on. Because if you fall off, you can actually break through the crust and boil to death. Right. So we can't really see it, but it's here. This is the Grand Prismatic Spring. Oh, maybe you can see more colors over there. Maybe it's because the smoke is. Yeah, if there wasn't so much steam, maybe we could see it. There it is. When the wind blows, you can see it. All right, so that was our visit to the Grand Prismatic Spring. That's pretty cool, huh? Never seen anything like that. It's like you're on another planet. Very, very foggy and steamy out here. Your skin feels fantastic. <laughs> I'm at Kepler Cascades. Whoa. 
ones. Uh huh. How do you know when the hot dog's done, Logan? If both sides are. Oh! <laughs> he, he just dropped a hot dog in the fire. <laughs> you gotta eat that one. <laughs> oh, that sucks. That sucks. Okay, Logan, don't screw this one up. Yeah, make it sure it's on. Make sure that one does not fall off. So Logan finally got to enjoy his hot dog. Number one was a failure. Number two was Dylan's. There Number is. three is his. <laughs> there, is oh one. my God! It turned into charcoal. <laughs> there it is, right there. It turned into a charcoal hot dog. Oh, All right, so now we are gonna walk down to the lake. Here's our camp spot, and the lake is right down here. Wow! Look at that. That's amazing, huh? So we're down here. I think this is Riddle Lake. On the map, it looks microscopic, but over here, it looks huge. Look how flat the water is. It's perfectly flat. Whoa. Wow. We're going to go check out this beautiful view right here. Oh my God, that is beautiful. That is beautiful. Let's walk down here. Try not to fall into the river. Oh my God, this is beautiful. So beautiful. I'm gonna go on this ledge. Okay, Rock, please don't fall. Please don't fall. I see a stinky sulfur pit right there bubbling. And look at this view. Oh man, that is beautiful. Check it out, we got an elk, a bull elk with the big old horns just chilling out underneath the tree. Gotta love Yellowstone. Look at that. So you could literally catch a fish over there and then bring it over here and cook it inside this little hot pot. <laughs> Check out that elk. There's an elk right there just hanging out by a spring. I guess that's a spring yeah. over there. The elk is just moving along there. Look at that. We're in Yellowstone. Hayden Valley, and right down there is a herd of wild buffalo, bison. Buffalo, right there, just eating. That's amazing. Wow. <laughs> he is just right there. So cool. There he goes. He's crossing. They are crossing the road. That was awesome. We came to Yellowstone to see the geysers and to see some bison, and bam, look at that. We saw it. <laughs> that was worth the entire trip right there. 
We are on our way to Mammoth Hot Springs and we're driving through Swan Lake Flats. And you can see these buffalo just hanging out here in this meadow, grazing. Look how close they are, they're right here. What's up guys, I'm at Yellowstone, checking out the buffalo in Hayden Valley. And I spotted another four wheel camper. Just happened to be out here. Introduce yourself to the world and tell us what you got, man. Hi, my name's Nathan and I've got a 2014 four wheel pop up camper. I got on the back of a 2008 Toyota Tundra. Nice, I have a Tundra too. Yeah? At home. Yeah. It, it's, it, it was a great build. To be honest, the four wheel pop up's a little heavy, so I had to upgrade the springs and rear suspension and throw some airbags underneath there. Nice. And while I was at it, I went ahead and threw a rear locker and uh, some some front springs underneath there, some uh, Bilsteins. Nice, nice. And then, of course, you. this is because you're full-timing it, right? This is because I'm full-timing. <laughs> I think you show this, this one part off. I wasn't planning on showing it off, but this is my favorite part of it. Oh, look at that. So it's got a, a full pull-out kitchen. Clearly, you, you made this, right? I did. I made it all myself. <laughs> and that is awesome. In there that pulls out. This is all of our kitchen stuff on this side. The That's back, awesome. we got some dirt bikes and another kayak and some stuff. So we're a family of four. We've been overlanding now for almost 10 months. Well, we've been overlanding for 20 years. Me and my wife have been over, <laughs> overlanding together for 20 yeah. years. Yeah. Um, we've done several uh, multi-month trips, and this is the longest one, about nice. 10 months out on the road. So we're having a blast. Unfortunately, we only got about a nice. month left, and then we're going to have to go back to the real world. How many kids again? We got two kids, a five-year-old and an eight-year-old. Well, let's end this with your social media if uh, people want to follow you. So we are on Instagram on Our Journey Overland, and we're in the process of throwing some videos together. We don't have anything right now up on uh, YouTube. We have like one video. It's terrible, but that's about <laughs> all we got. Sure, check them out, guys. It's awesome to see another photo camper out here in Yellowstone. And uh, I'm gonna try to get a wide shot of this without getting ran over. But look at that. Beautiful, they match, they fit out here. So much better than tent camping on the ground. When steamboat geyser erupts, it can rocket a column of scalding water 90 to 120 meters into the air, two or three times the average of the height of Old Faithful. Steam roars for 24 hours after. Odds against, are against your witnessing this drama. However, since steamboats, major eruptions occur four days to 50 years apart. Four days to 50 years apart. So we're probably never going to see this thing go. That's crazy. Whoa, there, that's, that's the best we're going to get right there. Right there. Oh, that's it, right there. It's going, it's going. Whoa. That's pretty good. Yeah, get up, get up, get up. Oh, it's going, it's going. <laughs> it's going. Whoa. Woo! Yeah, yeah. Woo! Yeah. Woo! <laughs> Whoa, look at that! Look at that! Wow, Leia, look at that! Whoa! We made it just in time! It was four days ago this thing went off. Wow! Look at that! Whoa, it's going way up there! I'm angry! Whoa! That's awesome! Back up. It's back up. Wow! <laughs> That's awesome. The rocks, it's shooting rocks up. Wow! So it went off like last Thursday, which was like four days ago. And we were about to leave. And just as we started leaving, this went off. Perfect timing. Perfect timing.